Okay, so this question is asked that uh, do we need to mandatorily check troponin levels in cases of snake bite? So understand that it's not necessary mandatorily, but if you feel the patient has chest heaviness or chest tightness, or if you see some changes in the ECG, then we need to evaluate by the troponin levels and of course to the echocardiography. But the point is, in usually in snakes, the raised troponin levels is not due to uh, myocardial infarction. In fact, it can be one of the cause, but usually it due to direct cardiotoxins. Some snakes release uh, poison, which is direct uh, cardiotoxic to the heart. That in cases, it, it can release troponins. Also, it could be due to toxic myocarditis. Uh, because of the intense uh, inflammation, it could be damaging to the myocardium. And thirdly, it could be because of the hypercoagulable state in, in certain conditions or the clot formation, it can have uh, myocardial infarction per se. So the raised troponin level in snake bite is not always due to, um, uh, uh, due to myocardial infarction, but it can be due to your direct cardiotoxic effect of the poison or uh, toxic myocarditis. So you need to differentiate because the management differs in uh, these conditions, myocardial infarction is treated differently, while toxic myocarditis and direct cardiotoxic effect is dealt differently. I hope this clarifies. Do read more about it. Thank you.